Safety. Take your safety off. Watch your finger. Aim up and shoot. Shoot him. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are going on another duck hunt and I've got a special guest with me. My girlfriend, Brittany. Hi. Finally got her out for a hunt. I've been trying to do this for a little while now and uh, it just hasn't been working out with work, but today we get to do it. Today we're getting a little bit of a late start. We got to the camp, it was really foggy, and uh, the tide was still pretty low. Not crazy low, luckily. Uh, this is, we can work with this. We got the boat loaded up, and we're gonna head to the blind now, so. I will see you guys then. All right guys, it's 6.22. It's uh, three minutes away from legal shoot time. Just got to the blind, we're all set up. I didn't think we were gonna get here early, but we did, so that's awesome. Uh, unfortunately, I forgot the wings for the mojo, but I, I honestly don't think it's gonna matter. I think it would do uh, more harm than good, so it might be for the best. So, uh, how was that paddle? It was okay. It was a little rough, but it was all right. <laughs> you excited? Yes. I'm nervous. I'm excited. Cool. Well, <laughs> hopefully some birds show up soon. We'll get you on your first duck. <laughs> See y'all in a little bit. Safety. Take your safety off. Watch your finger. Aim up and shoot. Shoot him. season now. Can you pull this down? No, no, no. It's got a shell in it. It's got to go in the bottom. You got your shell? No, no. Come on, buddy. In the bottom? Yeah. Come on, I go. You saw what you did? You aimed a little high. Yeah. The guns shoot high. So you have to keep that in mind. If it's on the water, just put the bead right below it. Okay. okay. All right. Echo with that good retrieve. My man. Hey, babe. Model dog. Keep an eye out. Look, look behind us. Come here, buddy. Oh, man. A nice hen dogri. Come here with that thing. <laughs> well, we're on the board at least. Good job, buddy. Well, guys, I don't know if I mentioned it or not, but this is Brittany's first hunt. So we just had a duck land in the water and I was gonna let her get her beak wet and water swat it, even though we normally don't do those around here. But uh, just a little high, right? Yeah, <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> so we're gonna work on aiming a little lower. Yeah. And we're gonna follow up on our shots. Yeah. Cool, well, let's get this next one. Okay. <laughs> well, it's been a pretty slow morning, guys. There hasn't been too many ducks flying and the ones that we have been seeing are kind of far away. The only ones we had a, a chance to shoot was that little single hen dogri that ended up shooting. Um, just had some look like they were gonna work, but they just landed out in the deep water in front of us. So, it's been tough hunting so far. I don't know, we'll see what happens. Oh, hold on. <coughs> well, if you see one, start, well, yeah, you say something, but start getting ready. Safety. On the left? Right here, right here, right here. Left, left, left. Coming out of the sun. Wait. Ready? No, 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 too far. Still, still flying. That's a model duck out on the water out there. Duck in front, duck in front. Safety, safety. Take him, take him, take him, take him, take him, take him. Take it. I go sit. Ah, come here. It's your chance to redeem yourself. Get ready. Safety's off. Stay low. Ready. Ready. Go. Yeah, take a shot. Okay, they were pretty far. That is ducks, that is ducks. Take them. Oh! <laughs> yeah, there you go. Just let them work. Ready? Ready? Get them. 
get him, get him, get him, get him. Clip them. Oh man, I don't know if we're gonna be able to get that one. All right, just had a dogree come from in the sun, kinda. And I took a weird shot into the air. Missed him. My second shot, I believe I winged him. Apparently not that good. Cause he's flying away. Whoa. Well, that sucks. I definitely winged that duck. He came down hard, skipped across the water. And uh, I don't know. As soon as I started paddling to him, he got his wits about him and took off. He is out of here. Hopefully some more birds keep moving. We're gonna get Brittany a duck. It's gonna happen. Good luck, good luck. Two more left. Man, today is pretty frustrating. We see a lot of ducks all out on the water and ducks flying in the distance, but nothing wants to come around. This is brutal. It's like a tease. Right there. Oh, he's gonna come from this side. Oh, right there. Take him on the water. Come over here. Come over here by me. Come over here by me. Come over here by Come over here. Take him on the water. Make sure your rib's straight. Go, go. Oh. One more time, one more time. Echo, right, Echo come here. Ed, hi, don't shoot, don't shoot. Aim up, aim up. No. You frustrated after that I'm one? Frustrated. <laughs> no, you were right on him. You uh, can't control the spray. Yeah. You know? The spread did not cooperate. That duck was a little bit far. I told her to take a little water swat at it. And uh, she peppered it, but you know, can't control the pattern. Pattern was all around it, so it didn't connect. Is what it is. Better luck next time. Yep. <laughs> this way. Safety's off. <sighs> you can't compete with live ducks. Live spreads always beat artificial spreads. All right guys, that's gonna be it for today's hunt. We just got everything picked up, got back to the boat and loaded up. It didn't go how we expected or how we hoped I should say. There were, there were birds around, they just weren't really moving by us. A lot of them were just rafted up as the dogri have been doing this season, but Brittany got to get a few shots. Yeah. <laughs> so it wasn't, uh, all terrible. No, oh. no, I mean, I was happy that I was able to use the gun, but it was the first time. Yeah, we need to do some target practice. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, <laughs> work on shouldering. Yeah, shouldering and following up, because I, I don't know why, I was just nervous to follow up yeah. on my shots. I noticed that you'd do one shot and then that would be a wrap. <laughs> all you <laughs> but anyway uh since we only shot one bird today i'm gonna do a jerky cook for you guys a little catch clean and cook do some jerky so i'll see you guys in the kitchen all right guys we are back home and like i said we're gonna make some jerky so what i've got right here is i've got the dogri we shot plus a few more ducks that we shot earlier this season um what we're gonna do is we're gonna slice them as thin as possible I'm just gonna use a filet knife. If you have like a mandolin or a meat slicer, I'd imagine it would be better, but filet knife will get the job done. So we got some dales, some Worcestershire sauce, some soy sauce, and a little brown sugar, and then we're gonna crack some pepper in it. And uh, we're just gonna marinate it like that overnight. So let's get to it.
All right, so there it is. Got everything all mixed up. None of the numbers are exact, kind of just eyeball it. I did learn from my first batch not to use too much brown sugar. If you do, um, after you package it up, it's all gonna end up being a little sticky and I didn't like that texture. So this is gonna go in the fridge. We'll let it sit for a day and then tomorrow we're gonna throw it in the uh, dehydrator. And uh, yeah, it's good stuff. Well, the duck's been marinating for 24 hours, so we're gonna pull it out of the fridge, strain it, and get it ready to dehydrate. There it is. So it's pretty straightforward. Just unzip it and strain it out. This is the worst part. It takes a little while to get all these onto the grill plates. All right, so we got the duck all laid out on the trays and I cracked some extra black pepper on them because I like mine extra peppery. We're gonna throw the racks on the dehydrator. We're gonna turn it all the way as high as it goes and then we're gonna cook it for about six hours. And this is just a cheaper little dehydrator I got for Christmas. I think they're about, uh, I don't know, 50, 60 bucks on Amazon. Super easy to use. Six hours later, we'll check it out and it'll be ready to go. Well, it's been six hours and these things are done. The only thing left to do is take them out and vacuum seal them or Ziploc if you don't have vacuum seal bags. This is my new favorite way to cook ducks though, guys. It's super simple. There's not a lot of cleanup and it lasts for a while, but that's gonna be it for this one. We've got one hunt left this season. Um, I don't really know what to expect. <laughs> Hopefully we do all right, but if you like this video, leave me a comment and subscribe, and I will see you next time. You can find me in a valley of the river, man, way out where the moccasins live. You can find me where the black water flows, where the saw grass sways and the cattails grow. Oh, I've been living where the law came.